<laughs> How adorable. But one day, it'll up and disappear. And completely forget where it came from. Just like the Oma. has matured, not only in his appearance, but in deeper ways, too. When we used to train together, I was drawn to his honest gaze. But that gaze is set far away now. Far, far away from me. Come, let's head back to me, Mr. Goose. You brute! I won't let you harm a hair of your head. This is none of your business! Go get by a horse. I don't care if you're tough. Stay out of my love life. Did you find my cats? But you helped me, even though you are but guests. The previous visitor's deeds betray that he has fallen for my charms. However, I remain my own person. My affections cannot be compelled. In your case, if it pains you to be apart from the one you love, you must develop the courage to let go from time to time. But I get so worried. Dioma lives his life as free as the wind. If I were to let go, I don't think he'd ever come back. All right, this isn't the time for smooth talk. This is a difficult topic. I've always dreamed of marrying Ryoma and living as his wife. But I fear he dreams of other things 
entirely. Perhaps trying to prove to him how much I'd grown was all to avoid acknowledging the ways in which Ryoma himself had grown. No more cowardly conduct. No more fear of change. I have to face him for who he is right now. <laughs> what a fine expression you wear. I look forward to seeing what becomes of you both when fate has taken its course. 